How's it going on my tacticians and welcome back to Tacticians Monday Matches. Alright, I can't really talk very loudly because my sister Rushy Ram and her hubby are asleep or they're trying to sleep, so let's try to keep quiet while we excitement over the fact that we are going into Monday matches between me versus Yuki FBI. As well as later on there'll be another fight, but we're gonna start off with mentality power. I believe this is what her name is. But in any case, I'm gonna be meeting up with Adriana and my Victoria, my Servi Servi and my Ponyta, and she's gonna be leading off with her Pachi Wisu and her to and her Tapu Fini. So now we're gonna set up the Misty Terrain and that's gonna activate the, the Misty Seed, increasing Pachi's special event. I'm gonna go with some shenanigans, so Pachi is gonna go for the follow me into the gonna go follow me with the Pachi Wisu. And well, Finny's gonna go for the blizzard and it's gonna miss both of my Pokemon. <laughs> my Pokemon did not want to get hurt. This is a tiny little thing. But I guess I'm gonna go for a leaf storm into the Pachi Rizu. That's gonna be a critical hit. Oh, that critical hit really mattered. I'm gonna go for the horn drill. That's right, it's the horn drill shenanigans of the, of the My Little Ponyta. And my, well, didn't actually hit. But we're gonna go into, anyway, I'm gonna go into another. He's, she's gonna go into another following me. This time her blizzard lands. So. That did no whole lot of damage, so not sure what's up with that Tapu Fini. That should, I mean, I know I'm Eevee Light, but that should have done a little bit more damage. But in any case, I'm going to go into another Leaf Storm here. Going to take down the Pachirisu once again. It's going to finish up the Pachirisu. Going to increase my special attack. And guess what? The Horn Drill lands. That's right. My little pony tush and Nenigans are about. Which is what this entire battle is all about. Which is for just, just me Impy and his shenanigans. So now out comes the the Jirachi that's going to be the next Pokemon. It's going to be shiny Jirachi and woo, another shiny. So we got another shiny coming out. But unfortunately this Pokemon is not going to last very long. And I keep calling it this Pokemon because I can't really, I forgot what its name was. So please forgive me. Don't hate me. I just forgot. And the Jirachi is going to go for a an ice pun. But we land another horn drill! So that's two for two. Uh, two out of three horn drills landed so far. So Jirachi is gonna go down to the horn drill shenanigans. Things are not looking good for poor Mentelli Bowers. She is just not having a good day. So last Pokemon lead is gonna be the Nuzle Nuzleaf, I believe that's what it's called. And the Togetic. So uh, Togetic is gonna get, uh, do some more follow me shenanigans. I'm gonna go for some ring up shenanigans of my own. I'm gonna do quite a little bit of damage, not enough to knock it out. I'm gonna go for a horn drill. It's gonna miss so two out of so two out of four horn drills have landed so far. That's not gonna knock it out, but critical hit onto Victoria with the X scissor and it's gonna bring down my servine. Poor Victoria, she did her best. Now out comes Kristen my Brakeson. So we're doing some more shenanigans. So out comes the follow me once again. So I believe this is my last horn drill of the match, and guess what? The horn drill lads! Woohoo! Oh my lord, these horn drills landing! What? Uh, these these are just so, these are just some fantastic horn drills, people. Fantastic horn drills landing. So. so Nuzleaf is gonna set up the set up the swords dance. It's gonna get, gonna try to do whatever it can. I'm gonna go for the flamethrower here because you know Brakeson likes to flame things. My Brakeson likes to blame er, blame things. So flamethrower things. There we go. So Misty Terrain's now gonna fat damn uh, Misty Rain, gonna, Misty Terrain is gonna go away. The Focus Sash was was up, but unfortunately cannot survive against the speedy power of my little Punta. So that is going to be the end of the battle. Thank you for the battle, Mentali. I'm sorry for the horn drill shenanigans, but hey, friendship is horn drill, people. Remember that. Friendship is horn drill. And speaking of friendship, how's it going? This is going to be fun. This is going to be a fun battle. This was a fun battle between me and Tucker. So Tucker's going to be bringing out some shenanigans of his own. And I'm gonna be bringing out. Well, I decided to try to run my VGC team just to, just for fun, just to see what happens. And oh my goodness, this is the what am I? What 
what was I thinking here? I don't know what happened here, but in any case, I'm going to be leading off with my light part and my fire. Most of Roxanne, he's going to be leading off with his Togetic and his hashtag Team Poplio, aka Litten. So, I'm going to go for the... Well, I should have tried faking out, but unfortunately, I went for the fake too, so try to one-shot this Togetic with the Ice Beam combo. It was not enough, but... Out comes Flamethrower from the Litten, so the so the Litten is going to knock down my mighty Feramosa. I can't believe I lost my Feramosa to a Litten. So that's going to be the end of my lit of my Feramosa. And Ashley's going to go pop back out, she's not going to like this. And I'm going to switch into Coralina, thinking, okay, maybe he'll try to Flamethrower my, my light part. So I go for the Accelerate, taking down the Togetic, to Togetic, that's going to take down the Togetic indeed. I'm going to lose some health, but nope, Litten decides to go for a nasty plot. Oh my goodness, that little Litten is up to shenanigans, so I can respect that. I can respect shenanigans, people. I can respect the shenanigans. So I'm thinking, all right, all right, I got an idea, I got an idea, I got an idea. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm gonna switch out my Coralina, and I'm gonna go into Tapu Fini or Tapu Lele for some shenanigans of my own. So, I set up the Psychic Terrain, and Battle Wheels suddenly gets weird. And I go into my Zen Headbutt. This is gonna deal some serious damage, and it's gonna knock out this Porygon Z. Down goes Porygon Z. So, woohoo! That's gonna be awesome this down. But, out comes Litten with the Flamethrower, and it's gonna go into Jenna. Ooh, that does so much damage, even if it's resistant. Darn, that's a lot of damage lost. So, out comes the Mew. So, uh, I'm thinking, alright, I gotta get rid of this Litten. It's doing way too much damage. So, I send in Tapu Finny. And so, that's gonna get rid of the Misty Terrain. Or that's gonna set up the Misty Terrain. I'm gonna get rid of the Psychic Terrain. That allows me to go into my Accelerock. So, hashtag plays of the day. Critical hit matters. If only it did, because guess what? The Litten is Poker Sash, so that's going to be not fun for me. Mew is going to transform into my Tapu Finny. So that's not looking good for me. So I get another Flamethrower for my troubles, and that's going to be the end of Jenna. I can't believe- I'm losing Pokemon to a Litten, people. How am I losing Pokemon to a Litten? Seriously, somebody explain this to me. Okay, in any case, I'm going to send out Tapu Waifu, a.k.a. Lele again, so let's see what we can do here. So, I go for the Psychic Attack into the Tapu Finny, because I think that's the bigger threat. I thought that was the bigger threat. Turns out, nope, it's the Litten. Once again, it's the Litten that's the tougher th that's the stronger threat, because it one-shots my Tapu Lele. I'm like, what is going on here? What is going on here? Alright, so Tapu Finny is going to go for... Um, my type of thing is going to go for a Muddy Water. Going to land on both the opponent's Pokemon. Unfortunately, the Mew is transforming to Finny, so not going to do a whole lot of damage, so... Blar. That's all I can say, just Blar. Okay, so I get, oh, I get a hit with a Moon Blast in return, and that's when I see the Mew is got leftovers. Alright, so now I'm sending in Coralina, so I'm thinking, alright, 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 it, it's not the worst, this isn't the worst situation I could be in, I think I can make a comeback. So it's 3-3 three to three right now, so Tapu Finny, or Mew, is going to go into a Moon Blast into my Tapu Finny. My Tapu Finny is going to respond with a Moon Blast of her own, and that's going to take down the Mew, so that is good news for me, I think thought maybe the Ampharos might mega evolve, but it wasn't for, wasn't no for sure. So I tried to go for the burn, seeing if maybe I can burn it. Nope, it's gonna go for a Thunderbolt into Tapu Fini, so rest in peace my Tapu Fini, she did not get a chance to use her berry, so that's gonna be the end of my Tapu Fini. Now, out comes Mr. Magius, hit Tucker's last Pokemon, and my last Pokemon, Ashley. So this is not exactly a good situation for me because, well, the Psychic Terrain is up, so I can't use any of my priority moves against the Ampharos, which is what I would love to do. I would have loved to use Fake Tears on the Ampharos to help my Coraline out somehow. Instead, I'm going to go for a Scald into the into the Ampharos, thinking, okay, if I can just get rid of the, the Ampharos, if I can just get rid of the Ampharos, maybe I can win, but my Coraline gets paralyzed. Oh, 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 my poor Coralina. 
This is why I want it. I want it. I did not want the psychic terrain up at the same time as I wanted it, really, which makes no sense. So I'm gonna go for the protect here, try to endure some, endure one turn, try to get one turn of health up so that maybe I can next turn get a recover off. So Mr. Magius is now in love with my, with my Ashley and Coralina is, well, protected. So Tesla Moon is gonna go through, gonna take Ashley down to her. Focus Ash, really go ahead. It really matters. Oh my goodness. And Thunderbolt is going to come out. Going to hit into Corlina, but Corlina is protected. So now we're all going to go for a round of reco health recovery for those of us who do have it. Corlina is the only one, so she gets some health. Now out comes the fake tears. So my health strategy here was if I can knock out the Ampharos, I may be able to survive and take down the, ma the, the Miss Magius. However, Miss Magius, or Mr. Magius has other ideas, goes and go for Dazzling Gleam. As he's gonna faint. I thought my attraction shenanigans could have saved me. Turns out, nope. Tucker says, nope. Your attraction shenanigans are not the same as my shenanigans. And I'm the one with the better shenanigans, so GG to Tucker. So, oh my goodness, that was fun, folks. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed the show. I hope I'll see you all next week for more Monday matches. Bye-bye! When you've reached the point where you can't go on Just come to me, you'll be safe from harm If you trust in me, then I'll trust in you There's nothing more that I need to do If you put your hands in front of mine We'll be shining through one at a time Just understand